Greetings, pod fans. It's time for the annual pod goes to warp con and then talks about it and does all this stuff. Hey, yeah. I hope they don't mind that it's nearly been a month since warp con. It's just I've been busy and work and, and tired and then there was sickness and they're gonna hate me. So this year I come to you with an emotional roller coaster of a story about a troll that became a person troll. But not only that, because he then became a very important person troll. Over here. Yeah. A warp con the staffer known as Trolls. So yeah, thank you, Phil, for letting me have your VIP troll pass. Or VIP pass when you were done with it. That was really cool. I'm going to keep this forever and maybe cuddle it sometimes. Phil was a VIP because for the second year in a row, himself and another friend of mine, Richie, designed the t-shirt for WarpCon, which you should be able to see on your screen right now. Dragon Skeleton Dragon Sword Dragon WarpCon, yeah! It was a super amazing design and I really wanted to get one, but meh. So, as I kind of almost maybe mentioned earlier, I was a troll for the weekend. Troll in the dungeon! And I was just kind of thrown into the screening slash panel rooms, which most of the attendees didn't seem to know existed. But it was still fun because I didn't really have to do anything, just sit around all day because, you know, no one knew I was there. So... Didn't have to do anything, it was great! And I was able to go to a superhero and disabilities panel, uh, which was put on by my friend, and he put it on, but he did it before. It was supposed to be really good that time, it was really good this time as well, but I missed it that time, and I was really happy that I was able to see it. So, Kiff, good, good job, I enjoyed it. And to keep with the tradition that, you know, was started last year, myself and Mike got fancy boxes! FANCY BOXES! Okay, and now I feel that I kind of have to speak about the weirdest thing that happened over the weekend of WarpCon. I got recognized. And it wasn't just one time. No, it was like, there were five people who recognized me from this thing that I do. It was really, really cool, but also it was scary. Because... I'm not very good in social situations. I don't know how to talk to people. That's not one of my skills. So, uh, that had never happened to me before and it scared me a little, a little. So if you were one of those people, thank you very much for saying hi and stuff. That was awesome. And if it seemed like I was, you know, not answering your questions or not really talking back all that well, it's just, I don't know how to people sometimes, a lot of the time actually. Cameras, they're kind of like, they don't answer me back, I can just ramble at them for a while and I don't, they don't really have ex expectations, just that I keep the, the lenses okay and... Mm. <sighs> so yeah, that's all I have to say about WarpCon, but that's not all I have to talk about. So I'm not sure if you noticed this thing on my head. Yeah, I ordered this quite a few weeks back and it arrived before WarpCon and it's amazing. Who are you? I'm the hero. Link. <laughs> yeah, I went for the black one because I really like uh, Shadow Link in Four Swords Adventures. I think he's a bit of a badass. And I was just like, gotta get me a Link hat. And it's gotta be black because Dark Link is really cool. So Dark Link or Shadow Link. Shadow Link in Four Swords Adventures, Dark Link in everything else. It's weird. So yeah, this is now one of my favorite things and I wore it for like the entire weekend of WarpCon. And some people actually thought it was cool. Which I was surprised by because usually people just think I'm an idiot for buying things. But yeah, that's all for today. Um, sorry that this took so long to get on the internet. Uh, I got sick, then there was just work, and there was just so many distractions and me just being bad at things generally. So I would try to make videos saying I have scripts, which is terrible because I've had so much free time but no time from where I could video. Does that make it kind of, it makes sense in my head, so let's, let's go with that. So yeah, hopefully you enjoy this and I will make videos, I swear. Sloan. So, I'm not sure if you noticed this thing on, on my head. Ow! Ow! Flick myself in the eye, I'm gonna, let's redo that. 